Well, let's talk about the Ballon d'Or. The Ballon d'Or is FIFA's kind of idea of who is the best overall footballer this last year. Yeah. Uh, you have won it three times. La Messi has won it four times. So you hold that at the moment. Mm -hmm. And we're coming up in January, I think, they will announce who has it for January, yeah. And obviously you would like it to be you. To be honest, I think you're going to win. Messi going to win this year. We share this stage there in FIFA eight years. Yeah. No one's did that in the past. It's only, only us. So it's good. I have a good relationship with him. He played for one club, I play for another club. He won the best for him, I won the best for me. So it's normal. We have a good relationship. You know, we don't have, we, don't, we are not uh, home friends, but you know, we respect each well, that, other. That looks like a very good relationship, right? I think that. Cristiano tiene, tiene muchas cualidades, muchas cosas buenas que, que a cualquier jugador le gustaría tener, pero, pero bueno, a mí me tocó ser como soy, a él como él y, y cada uno es, es como él, pero sin duda que Cristiano tiene muchísimas cosas que, que a cualquiera le gustaría tener. ¿Te extraña o no? Es, es la pregunta. Sí, yo ya lo dije ¿Sí? en su momento, era lindo Lloré tenerlo. mucho con Cristiano. Era una rivalidad linda, sobre todo porque estaba en el Madrid también y... Y bueno, ahora está en un gran equipo también y lo vemos de, de España. I was curious because we shared the stage 15 years, yeah. me and him. I don't know if it's ever happened in football, the same two guys in the same stage all the time. Those two, those two just keep pushing each other on, pushing the boundaries of greatness. People try and make comparisons of who's better, etc. Just enjoy them, yeah. man. We're They're very different footballers as well in yeah. many ways, and what, what makes one better than the other. Yeah, forget the comparisons. Yeah. Uh, they're, they're, they're setting standards, we're taking them for granted, we're expecting goals in big games to change games. They do it week in, week out. They create highlight reel after highlight reel <laughs> after highlight reel. We talk about players that, that, that get to the top. There's many players that get there and stay there for a year or two. Yeah. These lot have been there for 10, 12 years doing it. The yeah. numbers, the statistics are, are, are of these two yeah. are truly extraordinary. People can overlook stats. You can't, they smack you in the face. Yeah. The stats are incredible. To say that he scored more goals than appearances for him, which is 650, yeah. I mean, that's just not, that's abnormal. You're in awe of them in, in many ways, and they're at a different level to world class. Yeah, you can't look at that. Yeah. Like, they're up there somewhere, yeah. and all the other players in the world don't care what their egos are saying and what they think of themselves. They're looking up there going, I wish, and I can't get to that level. They ain't gonna get to that level, it's just, it's, it's like Frank said, it's abnormal. You, you get those sort of moments of players having a respect for genius. You know, when we see old videos, it's not easy yeah. to compare, but the ruthlessness, mm. not just the ability, but the hunger and the ruthless finishing. And, and the longevity. Longevity, game after game, year after year, scoring in important, important games, things that we take for granted. It's not been done before to this yeah. level, have yeah. it?